I'm Adri Richards and today I'm going to show you how an Ethernet loopback adapter works and this is on behalf of Think Geek as a tribute. So here we go. Imagine that you are in your network closet, right, and you have a switch. This is a Netgear 16 port FS116, right? So this looks pretty um, innocent. There's only one item plugged in, so you shouldn't have any trouble figuring out where that one cable goes, especially if you can physically follow it. But let's look at Let's create a scenario that most people end up dealing with. There's not just one, there's uh, several. So then we got this one, then we're gonna have this one, right? And you know how people do, color doesn't even mean anything. So then you got colors that are all mixed together. Okay, now let's say you need to figure out where this first physical connection goes to, right? And let's say it even goes into the wall. So now you're unable to figure out where that first one goes just by physically following the line. What are your choices? Well, what people can do is go ahead and start plugging in different computers and see if this light comes on. That can be really time consuming. Plus you have to have a computer available. You know, you gotta have a laptop, something, right? Well, there's this great little device which you can buy at ThinkGeek known as an ethernet loopback. And yes, I always label mine uh, because it makes it easier. And see, you even put it on a keychain. Anyway, what you do is you plug in the other end of the Ethernet cable that you suspect to be the one you're looking for. So in this case, let's go right over here and grab the other end. Here it is. And when I plug it in, boom, the light comes on. Now I could have someone, I could be on the phone with someone, hey, plug it into the next one, plug it into the next one. And then when I see the light come on, I'm good to go. So they also have other type of loopback adapters, but basically a loopback adapter closes the line. So we'll, we'll try that here with a, let's say we'll do the black one. Let's go ahead and follow that. I'm cheating because all my cables are right here, but just imagine if, you know, they were in different offices. So when I plug it in, boom, light comes on. So with that, make sure you pick up your Ethernet loopback adapter at ThinkGeek. It's about six or seven bucks. It's a great tool if you're in the IT trade. Thanks. Take care.